Okay. Um, I am going to be doing a vape juice review for you guys today. And um, I was just making sure it was recording. Because <laughs> sometimes that happens. Um, so my name is Try Ferguson 14 and I am going to be doing a vape juice review for you guys, like I said, and I'm going to be doing the Air Factory Mystery Flavor, and this is a three milligram juice, the one that I have here, and it is a hundred milliliters, and I'm going to start by doing a smell test and then after the smell test and I'll do a taste test and then after that I will do a vapor production test. So we're going to start with the smell test. So here we go. And uh, I'm mostly getting like a watermelon kind of smell. Yeah, it's almost like a watermelon, kind of like kiwi. Like it's it's a lot of different melons combined in into one juice. It smells really good. If you guys really really like uh melons, then you will probably like it. But yeah, that's what I'm getting off of it. And this juice, the ratio on it is a 70-30. So it's a 70 BG and it's a 30 PG. So it does have really good flavor and really good vapor production. And um, I am also going to do a taste test now for you. So here we go. I just got a message on my phone, but we're not going to worry about that. Hello? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm definitely getting a melon taste. Almost like a watermelon, like kiwi. It's a lot of different melons mixed in into one. Like it's a it's a true mystery, I'd say. And that's probably why they call it Air Factory Mystery. Because you really don't know what it is. It's just a combination of a bunch of different fruits. So it's hard to say exactly what kind of fruits are in it. Um, so I'm going to now do a vapor production test for you guys. And today I have the Wismec Rouleau RX300. Also made by Jabo, and I have the TFB12 Cloud Beast King, and I'm I love this mod and I love this tank. I cannot stress it enough. It's like my favorite mod and tank as of right now. And the RX300 uh, is actually a 400 watt mod if you do the upgrade, but it's uh, three 300 watts originally. So, and uh, it takes four batteries, and I have three Sony VTC4s in here, and those are 2600 ma, and I believe they are 30 amp continuous. And then I have one Samsung 25R battery, which is a 25 amp, and it is a 2500 ma battery. And it can go beyond 25 amps. So you can push it. Um, but sometimes it's not good to push your batteries beyond the limit. So do be careful if you do decide to do that. Um, but uh, the coil that I have in here that I'm rocking right now is made by SigPet. And it's a SigPet Eco V12. Or T12, I believe. Um, it's the T12, SigPet Eco T12, and it is a 0 0.12 ohm coil, 
and it can be baked between 60 and 350 watts. And this is basically just like the Smock TFB12 T12 coil, but I'm using the Eco T12 coil because I like it a lot better because I've been having a lot of problems with my Smock T12 coil where they've been going bad within like four to five days and that's just ridiculous. So the coils have been going really bad, the Smock ones that I had. So I've been sticking to these coils and these coils have been lasting me a lot longer. I can definitely tell you that. And um, I'm going to go ahead and give you a vapor production test and uh, I am rocking at 150 watts and it's reading at 0 0.18 ohms at 5.22 volts. So here we go. As you can see, crazy vapor production. It's really dense and it's really thick. So I love, I love the vapor production. And it probably also helps, you know, having that T12 with the 12 coils in it, which is insane. So I can tell you right now that I'm also getting really good flavor too off of it. And um, I'm definitely getting like a melon taste. It's really, it's really truly a mystery. It's hard to tell exactly what flavors are in it, but you're getting a lot of different fruits. It's almost like a mixed berry. So you're getting like watermelon, you're getting a little bit of like kiwi taste, you're getting a lot of melon taste in it. And um, I would, I would give it a rating of five out of five for the vapor production and i guess i'm gonna have to go with a five out of five for the flavor as well because really good flavor really good vapor production and yeah that's really all i can say about it and uh i picked this juice up for 31.79 at Wild wow Bills. So that's the price that I paid for it. So it's like a $30 juice um, if you get it at Wild wow Bills. But you can probably get it for way cheaper if you get it online. Now, I don't get my juices online, but I probably will plan on getting a juice online maybe in the future. But um, yeah, so that's, that's how much the pricing is. Um... So yeah, and it also comes in this box. It's a really nice box. I got the three Nick. Now, I do believe that it comes in zero, three, and six Nick as of right now. But um, they may have a higher nicotine level. I'm not positive, but I do know they have zero, three, and six. So I got the three because that's what I'm used to. Um, so yeah, it's really nice. Comes in the box there. And um, it is a chubby gorilla bottle, so you got that kind of style cap on it, and that's what the bottle looks like. And uh, it's a pretty big bottle. I mean, 100 milliliters is quite a bit of juice, you know, so it'll last you quite a while. Um, so yeah, definitely go and pick it up either online or go to, you know, your local vape shop and definitely check it out. And... Um, yeah, tell me what you guys think, you know, down in the comment section. And uh, definitely remember to uh, leave a like on my video if you do like it and enjoy it and want to see maybe some more vape reviews, you know. Maybe I'll do some more, you know, who knows. And I am recording on my brand new Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. It's got a phenomenal camera. I love it. Um, and I'm recording at 1080p 60 frames at the moment. So uh, you can maybe tell me what you think about the video quality and everything as well and the sound. Um, and that's pretty much it. And uh, I will also probably pick up another Sony VTC4 battery because it would be nice to have all the same batteries in my mod. So I'll probably do that 
in the future as well. Um, so yeah, 